Good evening. Thanks for joining us. Dozens of charges dropped against the four people deputies believe killed more than 20 dogs at a boarding facility in June. Maricopa County Attorney Bill Montgomery announced the motion today. It dismisses all animal cruelty charges against the owners of Green Acre Dog Boarding, Jesse and Melissa Hughes, and the caretakers at the time, Austin and Logan Flake. More than 20 dogs were found dead and injured on June 21st at Green Acre after being left overnight in a 9 by 12 foot room. The owners say that one of the animals chewed through wiring to an air conditioner for the dog room. Gia Bang live with reaction from the attorney in this case and also from Sheriff Joe Arpaio. Gia? Linsu, there is one charge still on the table, that of fraud for Melissa and Jesse Hughes when they initially lied to dog owners that the dogs had run away. Now, the attorney for those families here not letting today's announcement keep them from pursuing what they call justice. County Attorney Bill Montgomery decided to dismiss the animal cruelty charges without prejudice, meaning these charges could be resubmitted. That's what the family's attorney, John Schill, and MCSO Sheriff Joe Arpaio is hoping for. Arpaio saying he believes his department did a thorough job investigating at Green Acres. All four defendants, Melissa Hughes, Jesse Hughes, Logan, and Austin Flake are off the hook for now because the defense claims the theory presented to the grand jury didn't take into account there were issues with the air conditioning unit. The county attorney worries it could impact a decision from the jury. The news obviously a disappointment for these families who say through their attorney that there was plain and simple animal abuse. And they didn't feed these dogs and that was evidenced by the sheriff's report. There was no food in their stomachs except for the dog owned by the ewes. What a coincidence. The attorney for Austin and Logan Flake have, said, have expressed their condolences to these families and they say that they're grateful for the justice system but say that this should have never been presented anyway to County Attorney uh, Bill Montgomery's office. They say this was all a tragic accident. Gia Vang, 12 News.